With an FKC screw press, dewatering is accomplished by slowly squeezing the flocculated sludge and allowing the liquid to escape through the perforated screen surrounding the screw while retaining the solids inside the press. As shown in the animation, sludge, sludge enters the screw press by way of the head box at the inlet end. The sludge is conveyed from the inlet end to the outlet end of the press by the rotating screw. As the sludge is conveyed along the length of the press, it is squeezed between the tapered screw shell and the screen drums. Compression also occurs between the screw flight on the variable pitch screw designs. The dewatered sludge exits the press at the discharge end and falls down the discharge box. The liquid filtrate that was forced out through the screens is collected in the filtrate pan. The general mechanical construction of the screw press consists of several components. The key component of the screw press is the screw. As the diagram illustrates, the screw consists of a tapered shell to which a helical flight is attached. The outside diameter of the flight is constant. The tapered shell is smallest at the inlet end and largest at the discharge end. The screw rotates inside a series of drums lined with replaceable perforated stainless steel screens. The screw is supported at each end by spherical roller bearings. FKC screw presses can be supplied with a final chain sprocket drive as shown or can be supplied with inline mounted gear reducers. The screw, bearings, and sprocket can be accessed by lifting the top halves of the drums and bearing stands as shown. The FKC screw press also has the ability to operate with steam. As illustrated, saturated steam enters the inlet end of the screw through a rotary joint. The steam travels a short distance through a passage in the screw shell and then into the space between the screw shaft and the tapered screw shell. The steam does not come in contact with the sludge. Heat from the steam is transferred through the screw shell into the sludge. The major advantages to an FKC screw press are outlined above. They consist of simple construction, low energy, low speed, low noise, minimal maintenance due to the low speed, and constant wash water is also not required. While dewatering the graphite, the FKC achieved 87% dry cake with hydrated graphite through the screw press. We also achieved 93% dry cake with the addition of steam. In order to perform this testing, graphite was sent to FKC in Port Angeles, Washington. The graphite we received was a 2,000 pound bulk bag of 100% dry graphite. The graphite was then mixed in a large container with water to a, to a consistency of about 20% solids. The graphite was then bucketed into the FKC screw press head box. A series of tests were performed to determine the optimal operating parameters with this material. A series of 10 tests were performed with the graphite. The test results are outlined in the data sheet. The graphite was bucketed into the screw press with the addition of no chemical help. The filtrate was fairly clean, however some material did escape through the small perforated holes. The final product is extruded out the end of the FKC screw press and allowed to fall into the discharge box into a container below. The final two tests were performed with the addition of steam. This increased the cake solids to 93%. FKC screw presses can be manufactured for all size applications. Screw presses are manufactured from 200 millimeters to 1500 millimeters in diameter and increased by 50 millimeter increments. Thank you again for your interest in FKC screw press. Please feel free to contact us at 360-452-9472 with any questions.